I need you to not just borrow it, I need you to redefine the grind. Write that. Redefine the grind. Alright? Redefine the grind. And then we'll tell us a quick story. I met this guy named Zulu, the Big Lip Band. This is big in Richmond. He's a big, really big um, radio show host, right? And he meets me in the back, and we're at this uh, producer competition. And I, you know, I'm, I'm speaking. I'm coming in and saying, I'm not part of the competition. I'm speaking to the producer. I'm speaking to the big guy, right? And he's the big guy, you know what I'm saying? So he said, Look, man, uh, this is how he talked to me. He was like, Yo, my show, I love what you're doing, man. You know, you're tight, you know, and all that. You know, all that, right? And he said, But tell me this who's your great grandpa? And I said, how did you just go ultra Malcolm X? Like you, you were just, you were just beating me up, and then you went ultra Malcolm X. Like you just all of a sudden black power. Like you just went there, right? And I said, I, I, I couldn't even, I couldn't even think. And he said, who? He said, who is Martin Luther King? I said, he's the one who brought the civil rights movement. He changed the world. He, he said, I said, I said. Um, then he said, who is Socrates? I said, great writer, great thinker. He said, how do you know your great grandfather was a great thinker? He said, the same way that you feel about your great grandfather. It's the same way your great grandchildren is going to feel about you. So I don't need motivation. I don't need to come here to motivate you. I need you to be self motivated. Because what you're doing and what you're being here is not for it's not for Kip Strive. It's not for her. It's not for me. It's for people that ain't even born yet. It's for people in your family. I don't know about y'all, but I don't have older meals. I don't, I don't, you know, great grandfather. I, I don't have that. I can't go. I can't go in my house right now. See, my grandfather, grandfather, he killed a man, and he he was in jail my dad's whole life. So I don't have the you know great grandfather with the smell in my house. I don't have that. I don't have that. So if you are, if you know that about me, you're lighting the torch. But there still are no excuses. There still is no days off. Write that down. No excuses. No days. No breaks. You can't go to Walmart and get success, baby. You can't go get the first place ain't had a Cali Crunch bag, dog. <laughs> you feel me? Like you can't you, you can't go and get and get get, get a scholarship to Spelman. You can't go. No. You can't go get a scholarship to Morehouse by changing the remote control at T. The dream, the dream. Can't you see? I know you did it before. You put the beats on and you can see LeBron. You know what I'm saying? You can hear Jay Z. You can hear whoever your artist is, and you're attracted to them. Why are you attracted to them? Because they're phenomenal. And you're phenomenal. You know why you're phenomenal? Because, ladies, excuse me, you beat millions of sperm just to get here. I always get laughs. It's okay. You, can laugh. <laughs> you beat millions of sperm to get here. Seriously. You were born a winner. You can't even contemplate suicide. I'm like, Drake, I can't commit suicide. Too alive. <laughs> <laughs> This is what we do. We are, who, who are we? We black men. This is, this is, this is the empowered males. I couldn't miss this. Dude, it's not the amount of money that can get me here. She told me there were some people here that requested me back. I'm here. We drove seven hours to do whatever, whatever, whatever is why. I get to leave out here and be Maestro Turk. I work for Kendra Lamar, I'm with Yo Gotti. But what are you going to do, my brother? What are you going to do? Look at me and see you. Don't look at me and see me. Look at me and see what's possible for you. I got two arms. I got two hands. I got ten fingers. I got two feet. Well, you should be ready. Yo, yo, you should be ready. That's it. I just gave you the game. There is no secret to success. That's a lie. The secret is hard work. So I go into the gym every day, and I, and I say, you know what, I got tired of being a chunky dude. So I say, you know what, I'm going to go in the gym, and I grab pain, and I sat right there. I say, you know what, pain, you sit right there, and I order breakfast. I say, I ain't leaving, because I need you to get to the next level. I need you to get to the Y'all missing me. I need you to get to the next level, because I'm tired of being a, a, a consumer. I want to be a producer. I'm tired of buying everybody, so I want to be an entrepreneur. I'm tired of watching Jay Z. I want to be. I, wanna, I don't want to be the next Jay Z. I want to be the first Maestro Turner. I will be. I will be using those stars when they look just like it up in the sky. We need you. We need you.